Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone, welcome back to Ghost Recon Wildlands. Driving, I'm on a gun. Okay. Fucking assholes. You're gonna have to get ahead of him, and then you're gonna have to turn towards me. Way ahead of him. That's alright. I didn't realize there were so many uh, SAM sites in the area. Go for it. Fucking hell! How do you escape? Damn it, I thought we had a fix on it. What the fuck? Alright, let's get a vehicle. There you go. Alright. Guys, pick a mission. Let's convoy. Did you say you picked a mission? Oh, no, no. Uh, guys, go ahead and pick a mission. Chris, if you want to pick a, pick a mission that you want to do, we follow you. We've picked up get in the side the There we go. Oh, well, let me get in. Find this guy and bring him in. He could tell us a lot about the cartel's training program. All right, let's go. Okay. Why don't we just fast? All right, push. Push through. God, I feel like I haven't played this game forever. Hang all the buttons. I'm gonna. Oh, fuck.
Yeah, I don't I don't know why we just didn't fast travel. <coughs> Helicopter. Alright, let's murk him. This one has bad guy. Frag out. All right. Everybody get on the on the uh, helicopter. I can't deal with lag. Someone's laggy internet. Hey, what's up, Batty? Alright, go ahead, uh, go to the north side where that hill is. Let's go ahead and sit down in that green thicket over there, and we'll sneak up on the target. Make sure sound suppressors are on. Drone up. The drone is up. Hold what you got, guys. I've got eyes on the package. Go, go, go. Deploying drone. 
All right. Number two. There. I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. Hold your Send fire, guys. Storm marking target. All right, I'm gonna take out the sniper real quick, just so we're clear up top. That's one down. I got a clear shot. Who are you shooting? Never mind. All right, I got uh, I got the I got eyes on the actual package, but if you guys can start taking out uh, the guys on the outside perimeter, all the way in the front, around the. Not that guy, not that guy. These guys. Make your way around, start killing those guys first. Watch the helicopter. Target eliminated. Go ahead, move. Keep going around. Move around and kill those guys in the front. Alright, that guy by the car gets all the way to the car and stops. Go ahead and take him. Alright, hit him now. Make sure you guys are using sound suppressors. Alright. HPML, can you go back and get the chopper real quick? Because as soon as uh, as soon as I grab this dude, I want to I want to uh, shove him. In. Got it. I'll tell you when the I'll tell you when. The... Don't move in on the package, guys. I'm gonna get him. Let me know when you got the the chopper coming in. In it and ready. All right. Go ahead and uh, get a hovering pattern right uh, near me. As soon as I grab him, stay stay behind me though. I don't want this dude to see you. facing right now, so hold Ah. Oh. Made me kill him. Ah. Oh. Let's try one more. Okay. Okay, that was funny.
Alright, on me, guys. I'm looking at a small group of tangos. I'm gonna request the choppers that we would get, uh, get them out quick. The rebels are pretty cool after chasing this vehicles. Alright, that's where the helicopter is, right by the road. Got eyes on another search party. We gotta be in the right grid. Cartel's closing in. We best haul ass and find this dude before they do. Copy that. That's a second target. And that's three. Drone is airborne. Alright, if somebody can get around and kill that sniper. Eyes on a small group of Got tangos. It. I asked the rebels to recon the area for us. I've got eyes on the package. Go, go, go. I'm looking at a small group of tangos. Target down. Deploying drone. Enemy down. All right, somebody go back and get the chopper real quick. I'm gonna grab the try one more time to grab. The I'll fly. Alright, I got him. Let's bring, bring the chopper down. Everybody else get in that car. Right here, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna dip as soon as, uh... And then, Chris, you're gonna take them back to the extract. Alright, I'll drive. Alright, let's go. Get out quick. They're gonna be coming. Alright, let's make sure we can cover the car. Alright, keep moving, keep moving. Get back on mission. They put a hammer in my hand and made me kill a 15 year old boy. Me obligado, te lo juro. I can still hear his scream. I'd rather die than go back, you hear me? Kill me now. Kill me. Ana de pendejo. For God's sake, kid. Do I look cartel to you? Pero compa, si no. If you are in Santa Blanca, who are you? You got a name? Emilio. Shut the fuck up, Emilio. Come on, Emilio. There's someone I want you to meet. Good job, guys. Let's get him out. No! Let me go! No se mueve. You want to get away from the cartel, Emilio? I can make that happen. But I need something from you. What can you tell me about the man running the camp? Carajo, I don't know. He's a gringo. Big man. Guys like stones, you know? It's malo. Even the guards are scared of him. He got a name? One of the instructors... Good job, everybody. Bookhart. Carl Bookhart? Gave us a name.
Carl Bookhart. Dude's an American? If he's the guy I'm thinking of, he used to be an army ranger. We even served together for a while. A ranger? No fucking way. Bowman's getting confirmation now. She'll get back to us when she knows for sure. <laughs> Shit balls. I'll get it down. for you on Carl Bookhart. Looks like you were right. His 214 has him in Iraq with 3rd Battalion, 75th Ranger Regiment back in 03, discharged in 06, and then he drops off the radar. I'm getting the notion he's kept in shape. Our deserter tells me he's at a cartel base located inside the abandoned Choza Padre silver mine. Find Bookhart, take him out. Killing him will disrupt the cartel's training program for months. Copy that. We'll get it done. <laughs> We've got a positive ID on the cartel senior instructor, a former army ranger named Carl Bookhart. The guy broke bad when he went to work for the cartel. Now we've got to eliminate him. Sniper on the roof. I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. Closing in on Bookhart's last known location. We really gonna do this, boss? Kill one of our own? Bookhart stopped being our brother the day he went to work for the cartel. You see him, you take him out. No hesitation. Jesus, it smells like a slaughterhouse in here. The hell kind of training is Bookhart doing? The first thing a Sakaira recruit learns is what it feels like to kill a human being. They bring in prisoners and make the recruits take turns on them with hammers or machetes. Sometimes it's men, sometimes women, sometimes it's little kids. And the recruits know that if they hesitate, they're next. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Target carrying submachine guns. Target spotted. 
Just spotted one with submachine guns. Deploying drone. He makes five. I got a target carrying submachine guns. I asked the rebels to recon the area for us. Second target, right there. Eyes on the third. Finally found the ammo. We got a mounted weapon. We're good, go. Got eyes on Bookard, target marked. Eyes on a small group of tangos. We got him. Bookard's dead. Hell of a way for him. Good work in Montaoc. Losing Bookard's gonna have a major impact on the cartel's training program. Santa Blanca's best troops are gonna be stretched thin to try and cover for the loss. It'll compromise their security and get us one step closer to El Muro. Damn right. The cartel's been calling the shots in Bolivia for years. Now, finally, we're starting to push back. Keep at it. Let's get back to it. Hell of a way for a ranger to die. Bukhard chose this. Don't forget that. We did what we had to do. Big news. Sueño told El Muro to take out La Plaga. But instead of killing his kid brother, El Muro's trying to sneak him out of the country. 
so Swinia's right-hand man is turning against him. Even better. We know where La Plaga is. Let's wrap this up. I'm tired of execution videos. This will be our pleasure. All right, come pick me up. We've got a location on El Pozzolero. Go and get this bastard and bring him to me. He's got a lot to answer for. Oh. Sir, I'm extremely tired. I haven't been sleeping well. And when I play a game, I get Hold so on. focused in, and I don't even realize it. And I apologize for that, guys. Okay. And when I don't have someone talk to you, like Helen or something, I can still focus into games. But yeah, like I'd love to do more, like talk, learn to talk more, but it's just so hard. Excuse me. And I know I do a lot of pre recordings, and I literally haven't played this game in almost a month. But for you guys, it won't feel like that. It will feel like just a couple days ago, I already recorded. It's because I, I pre record a lot. So. Oh, I think... Can you go for A? They got alarms rigged up. Yeah, I can't get that one. Got a sniper out there. Arms rigged up. What's up? I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. The Jenny's over here. Coming up on the cartel base now. Let's go find El Pozolero.
cartel metal over here. It's gonna break some poor thug's heart to lose this. the rebels to recon I got eyes in El Pozolero. Remember, we need him alive. <laughs> you guys smell that? Christ, the fuck is it? Death, man. Fucking death. I got eyes in a weapons case. Manos Arriba, let me see those hands. Hola, senores. You're taller than the usual delivery people. Staying overnight, I should probably have me also. You're a bear, like a teddy bear. Oh, it's not what you think. I'm not overly afraid of the dark, but Pepito will think I'm cheating on him. Media Flores once gave me a jirafa azul, and Pepito said the nastiest things to him. I had to spank him. Pepito, that is, not the giraffe. Is this guy for real, or is he fucking with us? I think he's fucking for real. Something kept his mind from growing up the whole way. Americans curse as much as you do? I'm supposed to wash away an American this week, but he hasn't arrived yet. Not that it would matter to me if he cursed much or not. Let's get back to business. Do all Americans curse as much as you do? I'm supposed to wash away an American this week, but he hasn't arrived yet. Not that it would matter to me if he cares much or not. I just do my job. I don't judge other people. Wash away an American? You mean put this American in a barrel and cover him with lye? Claro que sí. Some of the other men with guns, they call me El Pozolero, the stew maker. But I don't make stew. I, I don't even eat stew. You just dissolve bodies in barrels of lye. Great. I bury them too. Hey, trouble, I'm on my way in. I can make it in there. Inigo Morales, district court judge, disappeared on his way home from work. Octavio Rodriguez, student activist. Kidnapped by a gang of our men outside a local bar, never seen again. Mirabel Castro, school teacher, last seen at an Unidad checkpoint in Santa Cruz. I remember her. 
She had beautiful skin, like an angel. There's a thousand more like them in this stack, you son of a bitch, and that's just this year. Every one of them had a family. People out of their minds with grief because their loved ones are gone. But they were dead. What else could I do? Midas thinks he's got the mind of a child. Probably has no idea what you're talking about. Well, he better have a fucking photographic memory. I want the names of every single person you put in one of those drums. I don't care how long it takes. Do you understand me? Yes. Okay. Then you will take me back, verdad? I must get back to work. I can handle stupid and I can handle grim, but I sure don't like seeing them in one package. He's not exactly stupid. He's emotionally underdeveloped. He didn't learn the proper way to react to the dead. Like his brain broke? He's disassociating. Exactly. I, for one, am not gonna let my kids burn ants anymore. Just one less guy. Okay, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this episode. I'll play this little video. El Mudo was going to try to kill me, just as I was going to kill him. Black is for vengeance. White is for safety. Gold is for success. Ahora, I ask you. How can any saint grant contradictory prayers from two different men? It has been my experience that gods always side with the man who has the most money, the most men, and the most power. I had lost the one man I could always trust, mi hermano. How many men would be more loyal to him than to me? How much power would he take? Would that be enough for him to take me out? I would always have an advantage, though. I grew up with the man. I knew how his mind worked. I knew his next move before he did. I just had to be patient. This game's so good. Let's get ready. Odds left. Yeah, that's the wrong one. <clears throat> so I only have this one, this one, and this one left. Yay. Mission. Hopefully you guys all enjoyed this. If you did, definitely hit that thumbs up button. It really just helped me out. And I'll catch you guys all in the next video. Love you guys and peace. Bye. Um, <laughs> Excuse me. Make sure to like and subscribe.